the show, Malcolm in the Middle, Jane Kazmarek, and musical guest, Shay Seeger. With the Matt Weinberg 7, now, here's your host, Conan O'Brien! Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the big show. I almost didn't make it out here tonight. Did you hear the, see the long pause between when they announced me and when I came out? I was like way down the hall, like filing my nails, and I had to run. And I heard the crowd saying, where is he? OK, that's crazy. But I almost missed coming out here. That's never happened in over 40 years of doing this. It's the first time. We have such a good show tonight. Excellent. Excellent program this evening. And I thought I'd start off by discussing, the, of course, the millionaire space tourist, one of my favorite. I love that we now have a millionaire space tourist. Did you know he's, all, he's back home now? He's returned to Earth. Did you know this? OK, great. I have your attention. That's all right. Crowd's just filing out. Oh. It'd be great if that. All my monologues start with people just leaving. They realize what show they've come to. <laughs> then slowly I get them back with free color TVs. Now, um, more about that later. Uh, no, the millionaire space tourist is back home. Dennis Tito, we all know about this guy, who spent $20 million to become an astronaut, is now giving interviews. And he said that the most poignant moment of his trip was the radio link up with his family back on Earth. Isn't that sweet? Aww. Yeah, yeah, apparently Tito said his children started crying when they realized he had wasted $20 million of their inheritance. <laughs> True story. Yeah. Ah! They're coming back into the room now. <laughs> Everyone was like, on that laugh was like, huh? Oh. <laughs> well, some sad news, folks. On Saturday, Cliff Hillegrass who was the creator of Cliff Notes, which uh, some of you may remember from college. Yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know my core audience. Uh, well, on just this past Saturday, Cliff Hillegrass, the creator of Cliff Notes, passed away at age 83. Yeah, and after hearing this, President Bush was quoted as saying, that's too bad, he was my favorite author. <laughs> Very. Very sad. This is a weird but true, a new study, a new study that just came out, has found that dolphins are able to recognize themselves in the mirror. Isn't that fascinating? <laughs> true story. Yeah, unless they've just slept with a manatee, in which case they can't look at themselves <laughs> in the mirror. True, that's, yeah, because manatees are whores. Uh, <laughs> I know. OK. Um, <laughs> they're filing out again. <laughs> and then I got to mention this. In Kansas, a clown is in trouble for exposing his penis at a party. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, reportedly, it's the first time anyone's ever laughed at a clown. <laughs> so that was kind of weird. All right. And then I got to mention, last thing I'll mention, a town in the Netherlands, a small town in the Netherlands, is planning to open several drive through restaurants that will sell marijuana. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, here's, here's how it works. At the first window, you order the pot. At the second window, you smoke the pot. And then at the third window, you order 57 cheeseburgers. <laughs> that kind of just sort of gets you through. I'd go there. 
too. It's called... It's called McWeed. All right. Uh, they're not a sponsor, are they? Oh, they are. <laughs> Sorry, McDonald's. Huh? Oh, they'll be fine. They're not an uptight corporation. Uh, they don't mind him. Im I don't mind implying that they sell drugs, not at all. And now I'm making it worse, la la la. I'm dwelling on the problem. There are lawyers upstairs watching right now. What's he doing? He's equating McDonald's and marijuana. Oh, did it again. All right, here we go. Such a good show tonight, worthy of a big lawsuit. We have an amazing show. Uh, really funny guy, extremely talented, amazing, amazing impressionist from Saturday Night Live, Daryl Hammond. Is on the show. <laughs> Daryl Hammond's with us. We have uh, from a very funny show, Malcolm in the Middle, Jane Kesmerick is on the program. Very nice to have her with us. And musical guest tonight, Shea Seeger, will perform for you. And right over here, Max Weinberg and the Max Weinberg. And Max, good oh, to see yeah. you. Max and your crazy Max Weinberg 7.